You didn't say my name right. It's Wheel Upon Chimney, by the way. I go by Tom. <laughs> so, I'd like to start this off by saying, hello everyone. It has been a pleasure being a part of the SSF2 class. It has been a strenuous and stressful year for us all. But, we persevered through those trying times and have come out of it as better people. A little bit about me. I served for, the, for five years as a hospital corpsman in the United States Navy. I've worked in hospital clinics. I've also worked alongside some, uh, some of the finest healthcare professionals you'll ever have the pleasure of working with. And I've also worked with people who are just in it for the money. And I can gladly say that our, among us, our classmates, we are all doing it because we actually care about the healthcare field, we, uh, we are very empathetic, we're caring, and such. I kind of went off trip there, because I lost my spite, uh, spot. No, uh, they look at me. Okay, there it is. So, throughout uh, our time together, I observed that you are all passionate and empathetic individuals, like I said earlier, because I lost my place, who do their best to ensure all of our clients' needs were being met and expedient care was administered. In my eyes, you are all patient advocates of the highest degree. I'm sure we would make Florence Nightingale, pr uh, Nightingale proud, but our instructors, Sir Albert, Sir Ivan, and Ms. Chua, being proud of us should suffice, because they are awesome. Learning alongside all of you has been a pleasure. We may have had some differences among each other, but at the end of the day, it never affected our patient care. For whatever it's worth, I am proud of each and every one of you. I mean, come on, we have one of the highest passing rates for our class at this campus. Hey! You're welcome. Yeah. Yeah. This is the end of one chapter of our lives. For some, your education may end here, but that does not make it the end of your story. Your journey will continue. I am positive that you will administer the highest quality of care to your clients and should the needs arise. I am confident that you will have the ability to either prolong your client's life to a higher echelon of care or save your client's life. For, continuing, uh, for those continuing your education, going for your bachelor's and master's and such, I know this course is tough, but I have no doubt in my mind that with hard work and perseverance, you will all make it. I would also like to thank our instructors. I have been learning about healthcare for the past eight years, physiology and such. I was always drawing a blank, but now after this course, it's starting to click, it's starting to make sense. I know I was working for a bit, so it's kind of strange that I didn't really get it, but you know, it all worked out in the end. You've all been amazing. I feel that we were very lucky to have you guide us through this tedious program. Rest assured, you should feel safe knowing that we are your relief when you can no longer perform, perform your duty as nurses. You are all great role models, and I hope to emulate your guidance with nurses of the next generation as well. And that is all. <laughs>